Hey everyone, in this video, I wanted to show you how to take a Google Doc from one account and move it to a different account. And you could do this with any Google document, Google Sheet, Google Slides, it works the exact same way. So what you wanna do is go to the account where you wanna move the document from. So this is the document and make sure it's owned by me. This is the one that I'm gonna move, something that's owned by me here. So I'm gonna click on the document that I want to move. I'm gonna click it here. And what I wanna do is under file, I go to share. So I just go to file share. Move to will allow you to move it within this account, but not to a different account. So file share is the way to move it. Previously, I used to download it as a Excel sheet or Word doc and then bring it back to a different account, but this is much easier. You could also click file share on the top right here. Go ahead and click that. And here, typing the other email for your other Google account. So I'm gonna do that here. And here, if I click the drop down, it's gonna just give me these options. So I wanna have can edit, that's fine. I could notify myself or not. I could just select that off. I'm gonna press okay, and I'm gonna press okay here. So now I have to change the ownership. Again, if I click share here, and under the advanced tab here, go ahead and click the advanced tab, you do have to change a couple of things here. Right now, I'm the owner on my original account, but I wanna make my new account the owner. So on the drop down here, I could select is the owner. Before it was can edit, but now you have the option is the owner. And then it changes the other one to can edit. So only one of you could be the owner. And now my new account is the owner. So if I save changes here and say yes, I'm gonna press done here. If I go back here, that file is gonna disappear by owned by me. So if you wanna see that file again, you'll have to go to owned by anyone and that file would appear, but it's under my other account now. So when I go to owned by me, it's not on this account, it's been moved to the other account. So if I go to my other account, I just switched over to my other account here. And as you could see, the document has been moved to this account under owned by me and it's no longer owned by the other account. So that's how you move files between one account to another account. I hope you found this useful. Please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel for daily and easy to follow tech videos just like this one. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.